Yes, I hope you are doing very well, sir. Yes, sir. Like, um, I read that if we don't lose anything until we start to lose our religion, and Allah says that if we test us with something of fear, so we should fear Him. So recently, I noticed that um, my father is now most of the time after sunrise. So my ash, my isha is uh, about fifteen to twenty minutes midnight. So my my prayer is uh, the rest of my prayer are manageable. And um, I've been struggling to learn the Arabic language since uh, at least 2022. So I keep getting discouraged and uh, forgetting, and most of it, um, I've been brainwashed. Like, if you should tell me something today, in the next 15 minutes, I've forgotten. So how can, uh, can you please help me in this kind of situation? And is the duha that says, oh, Allah, help me to remember you, to worship you, and to thank, give thanks to you in the best manner. Does it suffice in this, case, in this kind of situation, sir? This dua is narrated by Mu'ad ibn Jabal, may Allah be pleased with him. And he instructed, he was instructed by the Prophet ﷺ to say this dua at the end of every salat. So we say it before we conclude our salat. And we say it after salat. We always say it all the time. Your problem with memory is done through or is solved through practice. Practice makes perfect. So if you fail to memorize few things, repeating them 10 times, 50 times, 100 times, would cement it in your memory. And this is what a lot of the huffad of the Quran do. When they want to cement their memorization, they repeat the same ayah 100 times. And this would make it fixed in their memory for a, a, a quite a long time, inshallah. So you give it a shot and a try.